All right, so picture this. Way up in the Arctic, right where the penguins used to be before they moved to Canada, there's this snow compressor, right? Not just any compressor, bro. It's like plasma powered. Imagine a microwave, but for snow, but way bigger. They say it runs on 1.21 gigawatts, which is enough to light up Greenland for like a whole day or maybe just an hour. Depends on if it's cloudy or if the aurora is dancing. Anyway, this thing takes snow, like not regular snow, but Arctic snow, which is like denser because of the magnetic fields or whatever. And it smushes it into cubes. Why? For the polar trains, obviously. NASA built it in 1983, or maybe 2007, no one really knows because the blueprints were lost in a snowstorm or maybe stolen by some polar bears. So it's got these plasma coils that heat up to 50 degrees, which somehow freezes the snow even harder, and then boom, compressed snow bricks. They ship them to Dubai for the indoor ski slopes because who else needs snow in the desert? But yeah, if you touch it, you get a tan, like some weird ultraviolet thing. Maintenance? once a decade or whenever the snow turns green, which happens sometimes when the algae get wild. It's all very efficient, except when it's not, which is like half the time, but they say it's the future of snow storage or something.